Welcome back to the channel. I hope you are doing good. We are going channel on Subira. Oliburunji. Today we are learning about something special. Today we are going to learn a change. Let's say you are a stranger. Olimuntu atamanyidwa and you fall into a stranger. Era no tuka eri omuntu atakola chi atamanyidwa omuntu gwo tamanyi na etakola chi takumanyi. Chempise meeting a curious stranger. Okuzisinkana omuntu nga mupya oba mu gwira na enga ha si mwangu. Nga no nyereza ya galo kumanya luachi embere ringa bweri luachi uriao. This is a guy who is so curious. I have one aunt in Modern Tweets restaurant. She's so curious. She taught me a little of that curiosity. Everything she has to ask, why is this here? Why is this person here? She has to find out. Especially if you're wearing like I'm wearing. Or you, uh, you look so smart or you look so... Dirty. Ageza ako kuku wa saganyo ala vyechechi gena maso. E mubula mubo. So, meeting a curious stranger. Oku sinkana oyo omuntu omupia mumaso go. So, this is a stranger asking you. Oyo omugwira obo omuntu gota manyi akubuza. So, let's say you are a tourist. Ori mulambuzi. Or you go in a new place. This black ink here is for the person who will find you. Who you will meet. These words are going to come from them. Aha, wamusinka na wane Uganda. When you meet them in Uganda, they will say, Oliotia lero. Obo oliotia. Meaning, how are you today? They will stop you and say, Oliotia sebo. Oliotia nyabo, oliotia lero, sebo oba nyabo. The response will be up to you. Okudamu kuja kuva, jori guwa manyecho okudamu, either siribulunji or ndibulunji. I'm not okay or I'm okay. I'm not fine or I'm fine. Aha, echo kuviri. Ovawa. Ah! You're strange and someone say, ah! Ovawa. Ha! Ah! You start to feel your intestines boil, man. Are they going to take me to police? We found somebody in Zanzibar who did that. Ovawa. When you're a stranger, when you're a tourist, you look stranger and you look tourist. They, they'll ask, Ovawa. Meaning, where are you from? I always told them, I'm from Uganda, I'm from Ginger, and I'm here in Tanzania a visit and all of that we are touring around so you know what to tell them when they say where are you from they will tell you okola chi mu uganda okola chi mu tanzania meaning what are you doing in uganda what are you doing in tanzania that will be up to you to tell them what you doing jagamba for me i'll say ndi mulambuzi i came here to tour I'm enjoying life. I'm on vacation. All of that. So now the response is here. It is yours. For question one, you will say bulunji, ndi bulunji when they say how are you? And for question two, when they say ovawa, where are you from? You say I'm from Germany or I'm from Uganda. And then for question three, okola chimu Uganda, okola chimu Tanzania, mu German, I will say uh, ndimu luumula meaning I'm in a holiday I'm in a holiday that's what I said in, in Tanzania that I'm in a holiday I'm in a holiday enjoying life uh -huh. once you're done telling them that they will continue they are curious they don't want to stop there how long are you here hmm how long are you here? And the response will be Enaku Abiri or three weeks. You can say like we went in Tanzania uh, 90 days, you see? 90 days. Enaku 
Abiri. Once you tell them that, and na kwa abiri 20 days a week, they will start to figure out what they expect somebody spending a week or 20 days to be doing. And then they will say, ah, 20 days a week. Oberawa mu Uganda. Where do you live in Uganda? Ah, these guys are not letting you go. They are still asking, where are you? You found them on the way in Jinja, in Kampala, you're moving. Then you will say, this is your reply. Kuno kwe kudam you say, Mbera, Jinja, Ewa, Muwonge. Let's say we host you or you're going to live with us in one of the restaurants around here. No, no, no. The uh, guest houses around here. The hotels, we have them here. You say, a Jinja, Ewani. I live in Jinja at Mwonge's place, right? These guys are not letting you go. They will still continue. Oja kubo okola chi ena kwa abiri oba ewiche mu. Meaning, what will you be doing in the 20 days you said in that one week you said and all of that? So the response will depend on your kudamu na waku jasinzira kugwe. Ona kurale ondi kuduka speed. Era nsubira ebigambo birabika kwanga banna fe bagame ebigambo tebirabika nemba gamba baongeze video bajirabire mu frames per second eze yongera ko wagulu abajja bira bakulunji wale saving data So your response is ha huh? what will you be doing in the 20 days you say Nja kuba ndiabuli lunaku ha Something Lunaki is supposed to be here. Lunaku. Njakuba and Yabuli Lunaku. No Kuyimba. Njakuba and Yabuli Lunaku. No Kuyimba. I'll be eating daily and singing daily. That's what I'll be doing in the 20 days. For us in Zanzibar, we were uh, touring around and eating as well. And just, uh, you know looking at stuff wake up go in the city and just look at stuff look at people look at everything that's what we did and if you are going to be just eating and singing that will be up to you i'll be eating and singing remember whatever you say will give them a go ahead uh-huh so once once you say you'll be eating and dancing or singing, even me, I'm the curious one. I'll ask you questions. I'll say, Nga oje ko kulia, no kuyimba, chiche chirala, chonakola. Apart from eating and singing or dancing and moving around, what else will you be doing in the 20 days? in the seven days in the three days in the one month in the two months and all of that so what happens after that will be up to you we found somebody ask us that and we told them in uh uh in uh zanzibar we just uh landed uh there was a place called i can't remember you know the funny name there but uh, uh we were moving with a guy from the uh the ocean and he said what will you be doing in in the one week and i said we'll be going to prison island we'll be going to nakupenda sunbank we'll be going to visit some plantations there and we'll be uh visiting for dawn market we did that i have a video when i about the uh the the fish and i was eating the fish and uh, uncle paul was laughing at me and all of that so tell them whatever you'll be doing after eating and dancing uh so that is what i had to share today uh how you can handle a curious person you met uh hope you like the video subscribe if you're watching for the first time and remember every time you like you comment you subscribe you watch all of that it uh, raises the ministry that we're supporting here in bujowali in jinja uganda because we raise money from this and 
when you come to be a student to learn Luganda in English, what comes from that helps to move the ministry here. We're supporting 15 young people and we support the elderly in our community here. We give them gifts on Easter and Christmas and all of that. And we have a mentoring program that we ask you to come and mentor or, or just volunteer with us on your vacation, in your holiday. Give us two, one, three days. Come be with us. It's only uh, Saturdays. So we can have two Saturdays uh, whenever you get a chance to come. And God will bless you. You'll be blessed. And then we'll pray for you. And we will teach you basic English in Luganda. All right, everybody. See you.